Here we go, here we go. I'm out gathering some aloe. I'm going to make a whole shitload of potions. Since I always seem to be out. Oh, you know what I want to do is go farm uh, the unnamed city for a little bit so I can get some um, legendary repair kits. You guys down for that? Yeah. Um, do you know what the best place to get gold is? Um, the best place, uh, the most gold I've gotten in one thing, one harvest or whatever you want to call it, is in the volcano. There are these gold rock noses, and sometimes <laughs> when you harvest them with a pick, they, you can get like 200 gold ore. It's just nuts. No oh, dang. Um, but you can also get it from mining obsidian, and then of course you can find it in the chests and stuff in various places. I've gotten a little bit from mining obsidian. Yeah, but you don't get you you don't usually get a ton from mining obsidian unless you do it for a really long time. So yeah, that rock nose um, is the is the most I've gotten like in just in one harvest. And I know where a couple of them spawn. If you want me to show you. Sure. Is he? A, are they like boss ones? No, they're actually real easy to kill. It says I have to update Pippi, user and server management. How do I do that? Uh, if it's not doing it automatically. Yeah, it won't even let me click this update all button. Yeah, something changed with that. Uh, what you'll have to do is uh, get out of the, uh, off the server or try or disconnect. And what I do is I unsubscribe from that in on the Steam Workshop and then resubscribe to it so it that re-downloads and then that seems to work. It's funny that he still has that. Man. Okay, I think we're about loaded up here. She can take some seeds. What about you? Yeah, you're pretty full too. Okay. Let's do a teleport. Head back home, get a bunch of potions going. When do you think you guys will be ready to go do all that stuff? Um, depends on how fast this, um, Steam updates. Okay. No worries. Okay, I'm going to take all of this, but leave those two things in his inventory. Now, um, we need to make another 33 of these. So what are we missing? We're needing some demon blood. I don't think I have it anywhere else. Oh, I might have some in here. Nope, none in there. Okay. Well, let's load this up with aloe plants. I'm going to take some of this poison out of here because it's taking up space. Let's take that out. Take the oil out. Okay. Now, you what do you need to make these concentrated? You need an alchemical base. Do I have any alchemical base made up? I'm not sure. Stuff is so messed up right now. Yeah, there, there's some alchemical base. Okay, so make the good potions. That's gonna take a long time. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, okay, never mind. 
Let's just make the normal ones. Ain't nobody got time for that, man. Okay, just make a, a ton. A ton, man. Okay, I'm going to put all these poisons in here. That could go in there. Put the bones in here for now. And the icker. Sucks not having any encumbrance. Okay, I'm gonna put you and you in there. We can put the bees in. Ooh. Alright, let's get a full stack of honey. I guess we'll just stick the bees in. Excuse me, horse. Excuse me, pardon me. Put the bees in here. That can go in there, that can go in there. This I'm going to toss because we really figured out actually how to use it. Those two things can go in there. Okay, that gets, that's, oh shit, we're still 150. Oh, we got all this oil. Let's put the oil over here. That's a lot of oil. All right, that. That helped. So one thing we could try to do with the frost temple is drink some booze. Uh, that'll warm us up, but it'll also make us drunk off our ass too. <laughs> oh wait. Could be fun. Could be fun, yeah. Uh, rhino head soup is supposed to be good for encumbrance. I heard somewhere the chili's supposed to be really good too. Can I even make that? There is no chili recipe, or at least, well, maybe there is. I just don't know it. There's spiced tea. That provides heat resistance? That doesn't make sense. Why would that provide heat resistance? Oh, wait, what? That's, hmm. I guess that means it heats you up, right? Yeah, okay. Mug of coffee, cleansing brew, herbal tea, and yellow lotus blossom. Yeah, I got Dancer Dave for that, so I don't need to worry about that. Seed soup, soup soup, spiced haunch, spiced steak. What if you ate like a spiced haunch? And a spiced steak, if that would stack. I don't know. I don't know the answer to that. Okay, so let's see. We are going to need... Um, we're going to need some more demon blood to finish this off. We should have... Yeah, we've got tons of ichor. Icky ichor. I'm gonna save this bone broth. Cause that's a a base ingredient for something else. I can't remember what it is, but and then let's also put away or maybe we'll put some of these on you, a couple extra stacks. I'll be right back then. Alright. Why can't I weak aloe extra oh Weak aloe extract. Wait, what? What am I making? Yeah, just normal. Oh, okay. Well, here, I don't want the weak stuff. Let's just put it there. Okay. So, uh, where's the closest place we can get some demon blood from here? I don't even know. I guess there's like a queen locust up in the uh, northwest end of the jungle. She, I don't even know if she drops demon blood, though. We could go farm the, the sand beasts, but that, those guys are pretty far away, too. Yeah, I don't know. I can't think of anything. Oh, I know what. We could go kill that ginormous spider. 
Yeah, let's go do that. And that's out on that island. Look at all these obsidian arrows. It's a beautiful thing. All right, we're gonna put the star medals back. I'm gonna take two stacks of those. Oh, I don't wanna carry this uh, broken glass thing. I'm gonna doodle around. Okay. Yeah, let's go hit that that spider boss. We should get some demon blood off of that. A little bit of honey. Okay, let's do this. We can take our stairs down as far as I've built them. <laughs> it's not all the way down, but. Our days are coming to a close on this server anyway, so I probably will not finish this build. Because of that reason. here for now and we'll put this here for now all right so just a little ways uh, well actually it's kind of I think across the water from uh, the lighthouse place is this island that, and it has a bunch of spiders on it, including the big, ginormous, scary spider boss. Oh, Hi, Tarzan. Yeah. That was Tarzan. There's Varg's base. that island out that way oh we could kill those the ginormous snakes in the swamp for demon blood too I forgot about that okay well we'll see how much we get off this spider boss and then uh, oh doggone it I forgot my bow can't take me anywhere all right we'll just melee it Fam famous last words watch it just tear me a new one <laughs> I got the I got the thralls though Yeah, so there's a bunch of spiders on this island and a big boss, and then on another island just a little further to the south of here is, it's called something Sirens Island, and there's actually a bunch of dancers on it. It's kind of funny. But it's on one of the islands that has the, the boundary pillars on it. So that's kind of funny. It'd be neat if we could actually use boats in this game you know like rafts and arc that'd be kind of cool off these guys while we're here. I should probably save Hodge's Bane for the spider boss. That's why I want to go to the unnamed city so I can get 
get a thing to repair it. Let's put uh, this in here. Oh, there it is right there. Okay. So let's put some poison on here and... some poison on here and let's do this so we're at full health okay you guys ready you ready Valencia B Leon you ready okay let's do this you scary looking Stinger there. That big ass stinger on the ass. Okay. This boss does like a big. Pur yeah, I was gonna say. A big purple, nasty, corruption, gross thing. And it kind of hurts. Got the job done. It hurt, but we got it done. Skeleton key, demon blood, demon blood, demon blood. Come on, give me demon blood. There we go. We didn't get a ton. We got 30. <laughs> okay. Maybe we'll get uh, something good in here. Mushashi's Black Blade. Okay. That's a katana. Hey, cut that up. This does 60 health damage and 13 armor penetration. That's actually not bad. We have to try it. We have to try that. Just for fun. Okay, let's see. We have to put some. I don't want the chitin. We'll put that stuff. I don't want that. All right, good enough. Okay, let's go uh, kill some of those snakes too. Um. Yeah, we'll swim back over this way first so I'm thinking we have probably two to three more streams on this server before we wrap it up and then we're gonna start Isle of Sipta And based upon how the poll is going on the channel, it looks like I'm going to start a, a single-player Conan Let's Play Series 2. I've, a lot more people have voted for that than I thought were going to, which is cool. So I kind of want to do it. <laughs> yeah. Did you guys see that poll? Brett? You guys there? Did I lose him? Hello? Huh, maybe they're AFK. Looks like Discord's working okay. Alright, let's go get some giant snakes next. <sighs> There's a big... Uh, rhino boss, but he's kind of far south from here. Here, why am I running when I have a horse? Yeah, 
And there's also a couple of normal spider bosses. Well, normal looking like normal spider, except for big. Um, but those are way in the south west part of the jungle jungle so i think we'll just try and farm some of the giant snakes oh there's the giant snake island place over here too let's go hit that uh, slithering beach okay go away bird We'll hit Slithering Beach and then kind of circle around back through the swamp area. Steel and sparks. Steel and sparks! I did some testing um, in single player with thralls. What I did was I pitted uh, Leon and Delencia Snow Hunter and other, you know, named thralls against the arena champion and what I did for the thralls is I, I made a full set of um, the champion's armor and put uh, the master reinforcements stuff on them so basically top end gear um, did some testing with weapons and it seemed like they did the best with maces and shields so I gave them like fully upgraded decked out star metal mace made by um uh, I can't remember what my armor smith, or, or not my arm, my weapon smith's name is, but he's one of the ones that adds damage to the weapons. And then pitted him against um, the champion. And Leon, out of everyone that I tested, Leon was by far the most effective thrall. He he would he would kill her so fast compared to everybody else. It was I couldn't believe it. And Delencia couldn't kill her. I tried her two or three different times, and each time the champion would kill her before she could kill the champion. I think she's been nerfed since, at least since the last, you know, videos that I've watched on YouTube of people testing, like Fire Spark. But, you know, those videos are, like, around a year old or so. So it might have been, like, the 2.4 patch. I don't know. But Lindsay is nowhere near as tough as now as she was in those videos a year or so ago. So she's been severely nerfed. But Leon, oh my god. He is like just a unit, man. Some of the other thralls I tested. Um, I tested a bunch of uh, relic hunt, uh, relic seeker treasure hunters or whatever they're called. And they did pretty good. The Sumerian berserkers did okay. Not quite as good as the relic hunters. Um, but even, even though most of those could barely beat the champion, whereas Leon would take her out in one, one test, he took her out in less than a minute and had like 90% of his health left. I couldn't believe it. But the thing about it is it's not so much how tough Leon is. It's that his AI is, it seemed to me to be smarter. He, he would attack more frequently, whereas the other one's kind of derped out. But remember, I tested him against her like probably s half a dozen times, and it was consistent every single time. So it's just very fascinating. Um, but as of right now, Lean is by my top favorite thrall <laughs> in the game. So based upon that testing. Okay. Let's bandage up. I'm sit, sitting here jibber jabbing and getting getting banged up here pretty bad. Yeah. The katana has different attack animations than any other weapon. It's a little bit weird uh, to get used to. It hits hard, but it doesn't, it's not a, a fast attack. Right. 
Let's use daggers on this one. Oh man, look at the, look at those daggers wreck. Oh my god. They are just way OP. Hey, we're back, sorry. Yeah, no worries, man. I thought you guys probably were AFK. Yeah, we're just for a little bit. We had to figure something out. Okay. It still says wrong version for me, and it won't let me update it. Wrong version for Pippi? Yeah, and it, I did what you said, and it won't let me. So you you complete, closed com Conan completely? You went to Steam, you, un you unsubscribed from it, and then resubscribed to it? Yeah, let me see if I can do it again. Because if that doesn't work, we're going to have to get a hold of Obi because I don't know what else to tell you. Okay, so I think we've killed all the snakearooskies here. Let's go into the jung into the swamp part of the jungle. What I'm trying to do is get a map, map room made. Um, so that way we can teleport to places. It's kind of funny that seaweed's poking out of the water there. Yeah. All right, here, let's get on the horse. guys wreck the crocodile because that's what you do when you run into crocodiles and Conan you wreck them or they wreck you it's early game all right so we just have to kind of ride around these swamps until we find the snake spawns get out of the way bird Hand camp. Hey, back. Oh, welcome back. I wonder if the uh, queen, locust queen, sand reaper queen, has demon blood. Don't know if she does or not. Obelisk over here. Don't remember if I do or not. I think it's over this way. Oh, I know. I can tell. I'll look on the map. Yeah, upper staging area. I wouldn't ha have the mark on my map if I hadn't have done it. I mean, it's not likely I would, anyways. Snakes are further this way. There's one. Get the hell out of here, you over guy overgrown chicken. Overgrown green chicken. Let's get some uh, poison on here. Okay. I know it's super dark, but it'll get light here real quick. Bandage up. Oh, 
Okay, let's go this way. I think more snakes will spawn over here. the lower staging area. What did they stage there, I wonder? I was wondering that LA too. Troops, maybe? Bird? It's like he can't attack me from there. It's funny. Emir will have your heart, Outlander. Emir will have your heart, Outlander. All right, where the hell is that other snake at? Whoops! Damn it! Spitballs on these guys are like homing. <laughs> hey, so I had a question. You remember those bats in the beginning of the game that you come across when you're walking through the desert? Uh -huh. Do you ever actually fight those or anything? Yep. Oh, you do? You can fight them in the unnamed city, and you there's also a place called the Tower of Bats. I can take you guys there if you That'd want at some point. You have to climb that the tower bats though. Okay, uh let's go this way here. Let's get on the horse. You guys, or one of you guys, probably got this object called the Staff of the Triumvirate when we killed, uh, when we did the dregs. Yeah, I think we have that. And what you can do is take that to the Tower of Bats and you turn it into the uh, reactivated or reanimated staff or something like that. And then what it does is it actually speaks to you and gives you hints as to what you need to do to uh, to get rid of the bracelet. It's kind of cool. Let's go through here. There's at least... Are there lots of bats on the Tower of Bats? Um, there's one boss bat... <laughs> I can't remember if there's other ones too besides that. I cracked myself up. <laughs> You're funny. There's a whole bunch of them in the unnamed city, though. Huh. Okay. I guess. Uh, I guess we already got the other snake. Let's head on back because we probably have enough demon blood now, anyway. Okay, so uh, please tell me I put some of that on somebody else because we sh there's no way we only have six. We gotta have way more than that. Dave, look out! Uh, maybe it's on the horse. I was gonna say, man, <laughs> we should have more than that. Okay. Yeah, 
that should be enough. Okay, so uh, let's see. We need 33 more of these. We can do 36. Look at that. Okay, so let's do 31, 2, 3. We'll cancel that potion and then resume it afterwards. I wish these people would not send me work emails at 8 o'clock at night. Yeah, same. Same. Your, your people are sending me emails at 8 o'clock at night. Oh, my people are sending you emails at 8 o'clock at night? Yeah. I wish they wouldn't do that either. Just, just so you know. Nope, it still says wrong version. That is unfortunate. Um, why don't you see if you can get a hold of Ovi in the Discord and let him know what's going on? I'm having the same problem, too. Okay, well, that's good to know because it might mean that the server and myself are running older versions. And that's so, kind of what I was thinking. So he would have to shut the server down to update that. And then I'd have to update, which I can definitely do. But we got to get a hold of him first. Oh, I know what. I put my bow in here to repair it, and I need dragon bone, which is another reason why we should go to the unnamed city. It's about... 40% left. That's still pretty good for now, I guess. Okay, well, I'm going to work my way to the unnamed city. Actually, I'm going to build a map room and then teleport to the unnamed city. What else do we need for the map room? Let's take a look-see. We need 35 iron reinforcements, 75 alchemical base. Oh, All right, Obi's gonna um, do it. Is he bringing the server down? I think so. Okay, so that means I'm gonna have to get off here. In that case, I'll be right back. All right, sounds good. I really don't have any iron reinforcements you've got to be kidding me all right let's grab what we got in here oh well, at least we have iron so that's good all right let's just make um like 50 of these Okay, so I'll have to wait for that to finish. Oh, what else did we need? 50 crystal. Do we have 50 crystal? Yeah. Please tell me I have 50 crystal. We got a crap ton of crystal at our place if we need some. Okay. Yep, there goes the server. All right, I'm going to take a, a quick break, guys. I'll be back uh, as soon as the server uh, comes back. So be back in a bit. Oh, here he comes. Oh, shit. <laughs> he killed us, man. Right in the back of the neck. I didn't even see him come until it was too late. And then I, I panicked and didn't hit the dead eye correctly. Bad. Whoa! <laughs> okay. 
I don't think we're gonna be able to get that fish. If Tennessee ain't getting clean now, though, I don't know what's gonna clean him. This is a little dangerous. I gotta, I'm just gonna throw that out there. Oh boy. Uh oh. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, hey Tennessee, are you clean now, buddy? He looks clean to me. Confront the witness. Oh shit. Alright. Hey you! Get back here! Oh shit! Oh. Um that killed us! Oh no, because our health was really low. Doggone trees. Woo! You have killed a legendary animal, self without the trapper who can then craft it into a unique outfit. Oh my goodness, okay, that was <laughs> that was a bit nerve wracking. Should we loot him? I mean, if we're gonna be bad, <laughs> we might as well just be bad, right? <laughs> oh, we got bad guy points. What do we get though? A dollar twenty-four and some gin, and yeah, that's all we got. <laughs> can we can we take anything off the off of this horse? Here? Oh! <laughs> oh my God! Did I deserve that or what? Jumped on this horse and went and sold him at the stables. I think we'd make, don't we make like, um, oh, we can search the saddlebag. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> he did it again. You doggone horse. Ow. Nice horse. He's, yeah. <laughs> there oh man that was bad that was bad that was really bad Worst cowboy that ever, ever played this game. Well, I guess we're going to get our chance to double loot this place, aren't we? Assuming the fat loots are even up here, maybe. Oh, not good. Ah, shit. We're screwed. I can't get over here. I hope they don't, uh... Oh, shit. Um... We might be in trouble here. Let's run back downstairs here quick and get in here and block that off. <laughs> Ever out of wood. Oh my God. Why do I get myself into these things? Now there was a guy right around the corner outside that door the last, oh, he's still, he is there too. Okay, so let's block that off. Oh shit. Oh. This is why we call this the oh shit gun. You too. Yeah. yeah. I'm just gonna set that there for yeah. a minute yeah. and see if we can get someone's attention. Hello. Make some noise. Oh shit. What the hell, man? The <laughs> that window's open. <laughs> I didn't realize that window was open. Oh shit, biker, not good. Where are you going, biker? Okay, he's dead. What in the hell? Oh boy, oh boy, that's not good. Okay, we'll take that. And I think that's, oh shit. Where the, whoa, 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 whoa. What the hell? 
You are really creeping me out, lady. Will you just die, Edgar? Get your butt out of my face. There's nothing worse than having Edgar butt right in your face. Let's try this again. Um, I think we're just going to have to do a live one. That ought to hit him. There we go. Arlene, go away. Oh, not good, not good, not good, not good. So let's see if we can get to that ammo down there without getting it. Where did he go? Oh, shit. <laughs> for that, just for that, Edgar, you get buckshot in the nuts. Oh, shit. I wasn't expecting her to be, like, just right there, you know? Um. Yeah. Oh, shit. Where's she coming from? Both oh. of us. <laughs> he says we're good to go now. <laughs> she detonated a landmine, and it caught me and scared the hell out of me. <laughs> Oh, man. That's why this game is so fun, you guys. That's why this game is so fun. I just need one of you to call 911. We're being really quiet. It's important that I whisper on the video because they can hear my mic through the video. Okay, let's try this. Um, Houston? What's wrong with this picture? Come to Papa, Big Mala. Come to Papa. She actually got a whack off on us. Oh, we don't want to look at that. Big Mama's underwear is really scary. Um, give him a little something something here. <laughs> I love it. That never gets old. Thank you, Jesus, for an auto shotgun. <laughs> I killed that guy, but I did because it says return to traitor. <laughs> Never a dull moment. Alrighty, we're back. That didn't take too long. Um, so, uh, were you guys able to get on now? Pick some beef. I'm still trying. No, you're not getting that message anymore, right? I haven't got to that screen yet, so. Okay. Well, we shall see. We shall see. Okay, so we got 200 corrupted stones. We got 75 alchemical base. We're waiting on the iron reinforcements. There was one other thing I needed too. What was it for the map? Oh, crystal. Crystal. Right? Crystal, yeah. At one point, I went out and got a whole bunch of crystal from Hanuman's Grotto, but I don't remember if I used all of it or not. Oh, I didn't. There we go. Okay, so we need 50 of those. 
I've been using your map room a lot. Oh, did I already make a map room? Yeah, it's down by your stable. Oh, <laughs> that's right. I did. Okay, that's fine. Do you guys have a map room? No. You probably don't if you've been using mine, huh? All right, I'll make this one for you and give this one to you. I completely forgot I made one. <laughs> I was like, why are you making another map? Can't freaking take me anywhere, man. I tell you what. Okay. Yeah, I'll just make this one for you guys then. Because I'm just that kind of fella. All right. Is that enough? Uh, no, we need 35 iron reinforcements. So, 10 more to go. Come on, level 3 Sumerian blacksmith. Get the lead out, man. Well, not the lead, the iron. Okay, so we're back in business. Uh, we'll make that map room, and then I'll give it to the kiddos so they have their own map room. And then our first stop is Unnamed City. I am in. Awesome. Uh, to farm up some legendary repair kits so I can repair Aja's Bane and get some dragon bones so I can repair my bow. And then after that, we'll go to Sepper Maru, hit the wine cellar. We got to figure out how we're going to do the Frost Temple, though. How important it is, is it to you guys to do the Frost Temple? I mean, not that important, I guess. <laughs> you're not, you're not going to lose any sleep over it? I'll only cry for five minutes instead of ten. Instead of six? Instead of six and a half? Okay. Exactly. One thing we could do is we could reset. I could make potions for you guys if you can't do it yourself. We could reset our attributes and give ourselves a whole bunch of survival, and that would make a big difference. Um, you know, just to get in there and get it done. So that's that's an option. I think we should try it with like a some torches and a bonfire and you know spiced food first and see. Maybe, and some booze. See if we can make that work. Okay. You get back to making Alla Potions. Elixir of Numbing. Encumbrance, Accuracy, Vitality, Agility. Ooh, I wonder if a Elixir of Ingestion would help. That increases survivability. I'll bet you it would. What do we need for that? Purple? Dad, yeah. Do you know who Joan Embry was? Joan Embry. The name sounds familiar, but I can't couldn't say off the top of my head. Our veterinarian said that I was like Joan Embry because I was on the news with animals. Because you were what? On the news with animals. Ah. Well, look at you. Look at she Joan. said... Uh, Joan Ember used to be on the Johnny Carson show or something like that. Oh, and brought animals. Yeah, okay. I think I know who that is. Cool. I actually have everything we need to make that potion or elixir. So let's grind up these lotus plants. Do you know where to find blood? Like, just blood, not demon blood? Yeah, put, um... arms that you get off of people and, or and heads like you know sometimes you get like an elk head or a croc head in the the press and that'll give you normal blood gross i know it's sick man that's how you do it though i've got blood how much do you need i just needed to make a one of those potions yeah i've got about 200 or so blood. I can give you some if you want. Um, okay, so I'm going to make us some... Oh, I wonder how... Do those elixirs expire, though? Hmm. I don't think they do. Does this elixir have an expiration? It does not. So, yeah, I'm going to make us some survivability elixirs and see if that helps. Cool. Possibly... Helps us get get her done. I just realized the reason I was having so much trouble, I don't know about you guys, was because I have like almost no points at all in survivability. I 
I don't think I have very many either. So it's not a big deal to respec just for that to, you know, do the dungeon and then go back to whatever it was we had before. All right, yeah, let's craft four of those. And um, this increases grit. I wonder how long those last. I don't remember. I've had them before, but it's been a while. Enduring is grit. This is might. Numbing is encumbrance. Why would... What does numbing have anything at all to do with encumbrance? <laughs> I don't I don't know, I don't get it. Congestion enduring. Alright, let's take this uh, uh let's take this enduring one just to see how long it lasts. Okay, so we have increased grit for how long? Increased grit doesn't say how long I've got it for. Huh. Okay. I think I think it lasts, you know, a decent amount of time, like 10, 15 minutes or something like that, maybe. It shows that I have it, but it doesn't show for how long I have it. Anyway, let's grab these and take them with us. And we need 35 of these. So 10 more. There we go. Now we should be able to make a second map room. Sweet! Alright. It's cooking up. What? Oh, I guess it hasn't consumed the resources till it's done? That's weird. Either that or something's broken. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I guess it'll, it'll consume them when it's done. That's the one thing about this game I don't like. It should consume the resources up front, <clears throat> like Seven Days does. Yeah, totally agree. Because what'll happen sometimes is you'll put you'll start crafting something and then you'll take whatever you needed out of your inventory and then it won't craft, you know? Know what I'm saying? Okay. So as soon as this map room is done, I think we're ready to go. Um, actually, I can, I should be able to, we need to repair our sickle. Hey, I figured out what those fragments of power do. They, uh, you probably already know this. They give you more heat points. Yeah, but you can also use them. You can use them to turn into the the library, the esoteric artifact library in the unnamed city, and get special recipes. Or, like you said, you can consume them and get extra feats. Well, what are, oh, we came over here to repair this. That's what we did. Everything else is in reasonably good condition that I'm able to repair. This is what I really need to repair here. Do you guys have any dragon bone? Negative. Okay, we're going to have to get some. Yep, it just consumed all those resources. Okay, let's put this on the hoss. Because it's heavy. <laughs> Um, we're going to put the elixirs on the hoss, and let's put another stack of bandages. Oh, yeah, I need to make bandages. And we've got some potions, too. Let's grab a few more potions. Aloe extract. Spectre coating would be a bad thing to take with us. It will help kill undeads. 
Undead dudes. Undead dude duties. Undead guy duties. Undead guy duties, yep. Okay, let's put that in there, that in there. That in there. Slightly worse than dead guy duties. <laughs> um, I'm going to put these down here. That still doesn't get me unencumbered. Okay, let's do this. Put the stack of 200 in there. There we go. Now we're doing it. Um, spiced oysters, cooked pork feast. I should probably make some more. Oh no, I don't have any exotic meat. I need to get some compost bins going. All right, well, let's just go. Let's go. Let's do this. One of the things you can get out of the wine cellar dungeon is a, a special uh, water pouch that lasts like a really long time compared to the normal one. So that's kind of cool. Okay, we want to go here. Nope. Where? Yeah, here. Okay, I'm going to the unnamed city. So you guys want to just meet me there? Or what do you want to do? Sure. Keep Dancer Dave with us for now because we've got some corruption going on. Let's get our mace. Yeah, well, okay. We gotta get out of this corruption. Aiming with the sword. Come on, Valencia, why are you always so frickin' bugged out all the time? Okay, let's put this mace here. What happened to Leon? Where'd he go? Okay, um... Oh, I know what the problem is. I can only have two followers on the server. Let's get out of the corruption and then I'll send Dancer Dave home. Okay. Everybody come here. I hear... Combat music. Oh, there it is. I was gonna say I don't see where they're coming from. The what? what the hell? That was weird. That skeleton was crawling on all fours. Kind of creeping me out, man. Like a spider zombie in seven days. Okay, dancer Dave, you go home, and then. You guys follow me. Oh, oh, oh. I wonder if we should try and kill Red Mother. I'd love to get her bow. It's the best bow in the game. Pretty rare, though. Okay, let's kill this boss. He should hopefully give us a legendary repair kit. We need to switch to uh, Obsidian Arrows. Okay, let's do this. Ow. 
Oh man, he moved at the last minute. They always do that. It's hacks. Let's get rid of these guys first. Okay, Valencia, you better fight, damn it. She is so bugged. We need Leon to get aggro here. Okay. If we go here and take her weapon, oh, or give her a new weapon, and then set her here, sometimes that unbugs her. Boss is bugging out. <laughs> Makes it easier for us to kill him. It's not my fault that he's gonna bug out. Everybody's bugged out. I'm the only one fighting. What the hell? I'll come to save you. I just need someone to actually fight. Yeah, that's exactly what I was looking for. Legendary weapon repair kit. And we'll take the fragment too. Okay, so we are gonna. Uh, actually, let's just use Aja's until it completely breaks, and then we'll repair it. So that way we get maximum stuff from it. Okay. Let us move on. We might as well keep farming the city, uh, Forgotten City bosses. So we can get some more fragments and more re legendary repair kits and stuff. <laughs> And we gotta kill at least one dragon while we're here. And I'm gonna wait till you guys get here before I take on Red Mother, because she'll probably wreck me by myself. As Uberlete hacks as I am, I'm not quite that Uberlete hacks. We can fight the bat, uh, the bat uh, boss too, B, if you want to. You know what I should have done is I should have brought you guys your map room before I teleported. I didn't think about it. I'm sorry. Okay, let's take a bandage. Delincia, we left her behind. Here, let's. Dancer Dave, go home. Now, give me your a weapon, and I'm going to give her the star metal mace instead of the sword, and see if that unbugs her, because sometimes that'll do it. Hey, Logic, what's going on, buddy? Uh, it, it is set up, Bubba. It is set up. Just look in the description of of the stream, and uh, there should be a link uh, directly to Stream Elements uh, PayPal. And thank you very much, too, by the way, in advance. <laughs> uh, let me know if you're not if you don't see it though, but it should be there. Okay, here we go. We'll get these skellies out of the way first before we take on the big boy. All right. This is going to be fun. Oh, shit. I probably should have my weapon equipped if I want to survive this, huh? Ah! Okay, who's not fighting? <laughs> Nobody. <laughs> Help! Lian! There you go. are so stupid. They're so stupid. Okay. Let's help Lee and finish these guys off. What? 
And leave the horse alone. He didn't do anything to you. It's me you need to be angry with. Okay, follow. keeps backing up, so I'm not getting my hits off on him. I gotta get right up in his business there. Okay, we didn't get his attention yet, did we? All right, everybody, come back here, regroup. We 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 need to have a have a come to Jesus meeting here, Thrills. Okay, you guys are pissing me off. Your job is to attack. Actually, Delencia worked a little better that time. Okay, so your job is to attack and keep me from dying because we don't want to die. It's not good. You don't see it? Uh, let me take a look real quick. It should be there, but that doesn't mean it is there, right? Hold on one second. You know, uh, you can also find it in the... I, it doesn't seem to want to let me get into the description while the video's running. Oh, hold on a sec. Yeah, it's, it's, it's in the description. It's like the fourth paragraph down. It says channel support. And it says want to tip the old guy. All tips are greatly appreciated. And then it has the stream elements link to PayPal. It's, it's the fourth paragraph down in the description. Oh, I see what you're saying. I see what you're saying. Yeah, I think um, I think it's set up to require you to have a Stream Elements account in order to um, minimize, um, what do they call it, you know, where somebody tips you and then they take the money back out, and screw you over kind of thing. Um, so, yeah, that's not something I can really turn off right now. But don't worry about it, though, dude. Um, if you want, we can hook up on Discord later. But I just, I appreciate the... The gesture, nonetheless, man, I really do. Very kind of you. Um, yeah, what is that called when they do that to you? It's like a, it's not, it's not buyback, but it's, uh, you know, trolls will do that. They'll like, they'll tip you, and then, then they will uh, cancel the payment, but then PayPal charges the streamer for the, the processing. It's, it's, it's bullshit it is okay so anyway let's get back to this uh you follow okay so delincy is following lean is following now everybody is gonna fight okay either you fight or you die i'll kill you myself all right here we go whoa <laughs> let's kill this guy Get him. Get him, guys. Everyone fights, no one quits. What movie is that from? It's from a movie. I think it's from uh, a movie. Uh, <coughs> Maybe, but I don't think so. I love the movie. It's one of my favorite movies. Yeah, that is a good movie. I want to say it was like a war movie or something. Everyone fights, no one quits. Hey, Tat. It's going well, buddy. How are you, man? You should be on here playing with us, dude. Seriously. Ah! We miss you. Even though your base got destroyed. <laughs> Did you know Tat's base got annihilated in a purge? No. Really? Yeah. I was actually on the server when it happened, and I texted him, or I discorded and said, Hey, do you want me to protect your base? He said, Nah, don't worry about it. <laughs> okay. It's gone now. Oh, gee, that's from Starship Troopers. Starship Troopers. Okay. Yeah. Oh, nice. We got a legendary armor. A scorpion helm. Nice. Legendary helmet. The, <laughs> that's right. The horse. The horse was slacking that time. You are a bad, bad horse. I hope nobody from, uh, from PETA is watching me. 
I'm beating my horse with a mace. That's right, man. The horse wasn't wasn't fighting. What the hell, horse? What the hell? Okay, so let's give... Delincia actually worked that time. Wonder of Wonders. Let's give her the Fragments of Powers. Um, we got another Legendary Weapon Repair Kit, too, which is great. Or no, we haven't used it yet. We're just waiting for Aja's to completely wear down. Uh, I don't know if I want her to use that, though. So let's... What else could she carry? She can carry some bandages, I guess. Uh, we could give her this Scorpion Helm. It's, about, it's 88. It's a medium, but it's a legendary. It has bonus survival. Ooh, that could, that could actually help in the Frost Temple. And it, even so, it still has more... Okay, I'm going to let Delencia wear this for now. <laughs> that's okay we're we're not uh we're not gonna be on the server too much longer and then we're gonna start up a new server with um uh what's it called isle of septa so hopefully tat you can join us for that i am having some encumbrance issues i really am okay what here let's give you the elixirs just don't drink it okay it's not for you um, Blaine, do you have room at all? Oh yeah, you got lots of room. Okay, so let's give you this, and I don't want to give you the star metal sword because I want you to use the axe. So I guess I'll give you bandages. Okay, we're back in business. Let's go kill another boss. We're gonna go kill Set, uh, the snake of Set. I'm almost to the city if you want to hold on so I'll go with you. Yeah. Is Pixel with you too? She is just behind me. Okay. Let's go kill some uh, relic hunters while we wait for B&B. &B. You got that map too? Nice, man. Good. Well, you you have to play with us. You, you have no choice. <laughs> no, of course you have a choice, but we would like you to. So, I, you know, I was talking about this earlier on the stream. Most of you guys probably weren't on at the time, but I've done some testing um, with with some thralls uh, since the 2.4 update. Because everything that's on yeah. YouTube right now is like a year old, you know. And I've discovered some things in my testing. Um, first of all, Delencia Snowhunter is, has been severely nerfed from what she used to be. And some of uh. you... Some of you may already know that, but she is. Um, and what I did in my testing is I, I spawned in uh, the arena champion and had uh, the thralls fighter, and I gave my thralls like champion uh, armor decked out made by um, a master smith, uh, Osin the Smith, and uh, Delencia could not beat her. The champion killed her every time I I tried to try like three or four times. But you know who 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 kicked the shit out of the champion was Lin. <laughs> Lin was like just an animal. He totally took her out every single time. I probably ran her against him four or five times. Um. You know who else uh, works really well for that? Who? Dave Thomas, founder of Wendy's. Ah, uh, you. <laughs> I, <knew. laughs> I I just could tell something was wrong right after I said who. <laughs> Um, and the, the Relic Hunter Treasure Seekers are also very, very good thralls right now. Um, most of the ones I pitted against the champion beat her. I mean, some of them barely beat her, but almost all of them did. Sumerian Berserkers didn't do as well as the Relic Hunters, but a few of those survived too, so they're still pretty decent thralls. But I had a bunch of named thralls, you know, like slow leveling, like um, Dacius, the what's him call it from the volcano, and Aerie, the Ravager from the volcano. Hardly any of those guys could survive against the champion. It was just really interesting to see how that all went down. But anyway, these this is where one of the spots you can get the Relic Hunters, if you guys ever want to get some for yourself. Uh, I'm not thralling today, so we're just killing them. But um, they're, they're in like four or five different spots here in the, in the uh, unnamed city. But this is a good spot because it's there's nothing else around that's dangerous besides them. <laughs> and so you can set up uh, your wheel just right over here and then take these guys out and put them on the wheel. Yeah, 
If we were going to stay on the, this server longer, I'd come over and get some of them, but not really much point in doing it right now, so... Whose base is this one that's like all metallic and silver and whatnot? Is it along the river? Yeah. I think that's uh, Karnath's. I could just use this teleporter and teleport to you. Yeah, if you want to. Let me get back down, though, by the obelisk first. Um, so that way I, I can help you if you get attacked right away. It'll only take me like two seconds to get down. Well, a little more than two seconds. But... Will all my friends um, come with me? Actually... Yeah, any thralls that are following you will come, but make sure you have them sidekicked too so you can summon them. <laughs> yes, boss, I'll be there. Okay. <laughs> That's what I like to hear, Tat. That's what I like to hear. Have we taken pics here to the library and everything already? I don't think so. Okay. You ready for me? Uh, yeah, if you want to come right in the middle of a skeleton battle, sure. They're, they won't attack you, they're attacking me, so go ahead and come on through. Is Pix coming through too? She should be. No, I was not close behind him. Okay. Oh. Alright, well, um, let's I should just... be listening, though. Are you going to use Karnath's map room, too? I'm not using a map room, I'm just writing. Okay. Then let's get out of this uh, corruption beef, and I'll call Dave to heal us up. Come over this way. What's that skeleton doing over there? <clears throat> okay. Do your thing, Dave. Dave the Dancer. Everybody should have their own Dave the Dancer. You have a, a bow on you, Dank Dank? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, Audra's is pretty much broken, so we're going to repair it now. This is supposed to be <clears throat> one of the best one-handed maces in the game. <laughs> He's silly. Okay, let's send Dave home. Leon and Delencia B to follow. All right. <clears throat> how, how far out are you, Pixels? I'm very close. Oh, I don't want to go that way. Are you coming? You, you're probably coming from the east, right? Yeah. Okay, let's go meet her up at the gate. So come this way. You guys can stay where you are. Oh wait, down in the pit of sorts. 
There's uh, lots of nasty stuff that'll want to try and eat you if you try and get to us on your own. Not saying you're a wimp and you couldn't do it, I'm just saying. Are you in the city? Yeah. Oh. I see. For some reason, Brent shows up as you on the map. It always throws me off. That's weird. And now he shows Dank Knight. Are you coming through like the main gate, like the, it's called the Dawn Gate? No. All right, hold on a sec. I gotta figure out where you're at. Oh, I see where you are. Okay, do you see where we are? Yeah, I'm trying to get to this. Okay, we'll we'll move towards you. Let's go, B. Just forget about those guys. Hey, can you come back and help me? They knocked me off my horse, and now I'm getting like jumped. All right, don't die. <laughs> That's the plan. Hey, don't hit my horse. Good. Thank you, sir. You bet. Okay, where's Pixels? There she is. Crunchy snacks. Yep. Are you like on the staircase? Yeah. Okay, stay stay there. We're coming. There you are. <clears throat> hey, how did you get three followers to follow you? Uh, I asked two to follow me with the green follow and one to follow me with the gray follow. Oh. I didn't know you could I didn't know you could do that. That's good. Good to know. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Let's go down this way. Your stomach hurts. First thing you want to do is get this obelisk. And then after you're done, uh, run, run into this uh, big building over here, off to the north. This is the archive, and it's where you learn cartographer, which allows you to make your own map room. There's a chest right there, too, if you want to grab it.
So talk to the ghost guy um, <clears throat> to learn cartographer, but don't um, come back here later to listen to a story because it'll take a really long time if you go through the whole thing right now. Okay. But now you can use the map room to just teleport straight here uh, to do nice. that. Okay, now over here, Pixel, um, when you kill bosses in the unnamed city and certain bosses elsewhere, you'll get a fragment of power. And then you can exchange them here for special recipes that you can't get anywhere else. Oh, okay. Um, so that's the other purpose of the fragments of power besides increasing feats. Or adding cool. more feats. Okay. <laughs> what are you doing? Four more tea. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> Can I go take a nap? Yeah, if you want to take a nap in this place, sure. Pixel, come right in the middle of the map and look straight up. See that big opening? Yeah. I'll show you where, where it is outside later. If you want to know. Yeah. It's kind of cool. Yeah. All right. Now, let's run the hell out of here really quick, and then I'll call Dave in to remove our corruption again. And then we've got... Uh, I've killed two of the unnamed city bosses. I don't know if they've respawned yet, but we have three more we can do, plus the Red Mother. I think you mean our Red Mother, comrade. Is Genghis' uh, last name Khan? His brother's name's Khan. Oh, okay. After you get out of the library, go right. Right turn, Clyde. Your thralls are blocking the exit. Oh, there they go. They'll, yeah, they'll teleport. It's possible that that first boss I killed is back. We'll go. We'll go look. Okay. Summon Dave. Get rid of corruption. Yes, I am entertained. <laughs> Thanks, Dave. Okay, you go home now. Okay. Um. Actually, if. I could probably have Dave follow us, but he's not very tough. I don't want I don't want to lose him. Uh all right, let's get all of you. Wait, what? Come here. You follow. Where'd Leon go? Oh, he's right here. He's already following. Okay, let's come up these stairs to the right and see if that boss is back. He is. Awesome. Let's get him. There goes Delencia. Now I can't get her to stop fighting, but that's okay. I'd rather have her not stop fighting than not fight at all. So one of you guys loot the fragment off him and uh, get the, he should have a legendary repair kit, which you definitely want to get. Get it. There's a chest behind the brazier thing too. It's just got basic loot in it though.
Okay, let's go kill Set. <laughs> Some other time, Pix, when you have time, come down here and talk to that guy up there. That's the that's the war maker. And he'll give you a lot of backstory too, but again it'll take a really long time if you do it right now. Okay. Okay. Let's go kill the serpent of set. You can also get some gold and silver in this place, too. You go in the right door, right? Doesn't matter. Stupid cobras. These guys are small time compared to the big snake we're gonna kill. Put some reaper poison on my daggers. You guys ready? Let's get him. Hi. Drop a legendary key. There's a chest there. You can get a legendary weapon. And sometimes there's a fragment of power back here, but it doesn't always spawn. Glimmer moon. Oh, that's a good axe. It's a really good axe. It'll it'll light up dark places for you too. Okay, there's a gold and silver chest. There's two on this side and three on the other side. If you guys, if you want to grab them. I got lots of gold and silver, so I'll let you guys get it. I'll be outside with Dave to remove your corruption. Hey, what's going on, Sky Conventus? Yeah, it has been a while. How have you been? It's good to see you. Thanks for stopping in, man. Oh, we're starving. Uh, here, let's have some of this. Honey, it's good for the soul. We better drink something, too. Okay. Get your corruption fixed. You play uh, Conan, Skyken? Yeah, pull your axe out for a second. Glimmer Moon. Cool, huh? That's cool. It's got a built in light. That is actually a really good axe too, especially if you, um, uh, you know, put uh, a master weapon fitting on it. Nice. Yep. It's almost as good as uh, Yogg's Touch, which is most people consider to be the best um, war axe in the game. Okay, everybody done with Dave? Yeah. Go home, Dave. You go home now. Okay. Let's uh head straight down this uh this uh avenue here and then there should be another boss at the end.
How much time do you guys have? We should probably get the, hit the wine cellar pretty soon. We got some time. Okay. Right, so like 11 or something. Okay. So, somebody with the bow, get on the on the left hand side and line up these skellies and just start pegging them as fast as you can. On the left hand side, over oh, the other side, your other left. <laughs> okay, don't hit the boss though at the end. We'll kill the skeletons first. Okay, ready, go. They're all going this way. Nice. That's a lot easier with you guys helping me. <laughs> okay, now for the big boy. Eat an arrow, buddy. He's angry. Nice work. There's a couple chests over here. One of them, I think, has silver and gold in it. <clears throat> Without internet at home, it's hard to watch on Twitch. Yeah, I haven't actually haven't been on Twitch for a long time. I've pretty much been YouTube for the last year and a half. This kind of worked out better for me that way, you know. I still have my U my Twitch account, but I just just do YouTube for now, anyway. Okay, when you guys are ready, we'll go up the hill and do the bat boss. You don't have Conan? Oh, okay. Yeah, it's a good game, man. If you ever get a chance to get yeah. it, highly recommend it. I've really enjoyed it. Yeah, I know. It's, isn't it good? You like it better than Ark? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, for sure. I, I love Ark, I really do, but Ark is so hard to play solo and, you know, I mean, you get all the way through the game. Whereas this, you know, with the Thrall system and everything, you can actually beat this game solo. It just seems a little, I don't know, a little less complicated. Yeah. Okay. Everybody ready? Sorry it's dark guys, but it, it will it'll lighten up pretty soon. If it, if he flies way up in the air, dodge away. Because he's gonna do like a big slam thing. We're gonna burn him down pretty quick though. He did. Nice. If you skin them with a skinny knife, you'll get bat skin, and I don't know what it's used for, but you'll get it. <laughs> now, B, if you look up, you can see there's a bunch of bats up th up there looking down on us. Um, those are normal bats, though. They're not like boss bats, so if you wanted to kill more, you could kill them up there. Uh. And then there's a legendary chest right over here. What'd you get? Uh, nothing. It seemed to be just a normal chest. Didn't one of you get a skeleton key off of him? I didn't need a key to open Oh, it. you know what? Yeah, I don't think he drops a skeleton key. Yeah. Forgot about that. Then Ark? Yeah, I would say it is, Brett. I would say it is. 
I mean, and, but don't, you know, don't get me wrong. Conan is very content rich. There are so many fun things to do in this game. Um, you know, both from a crafting perspective and from a questing and lore perspective and just the world itself. Um, it's just that uh, I, I've just found Ark to be more com complicated and very difficult to complete solo. I've tried to do it before and I couldn't, I couldn't do it. Not without severely, um, you know, modding and nerfing the game to make it work for, for single player. Well, uh, Ark is, is is fun, and you can play it solo. Uh, you definitely can play it solo. I'm just saying that to actually beat the game, you know, from start to finish as a solo player is very difficult. It's not impossible, but it's difficult. Um, there's a YouTuber named Syntac, S-Y-N-T-A-C, who did a, a solo series. Um, he's He modified the game a lot to make it work, but... Um, he did it, so if you're interested, you know, check him out. Okay, so let's see. We have we have Red Mother, and we have one, uh, two more bosses on top of Red Mother to do, and then then we'll go hit the wine cellar. So let's go back down the avenue this way. I've never played Elder Scrolls Online. Is it good? I've played Skyrim a lot. Long time ago. I haven't played Skyrim in years. You like ESO? I used to play World of Warcraft a long time ago, but I haven't haven't played that game in since twenty twelve, I think was the last time I played it. Okay, so this is the biggest, baddest ass dragon in the game. Well, the undead dragon's pretty tough, too. <laughs> what the hell? Stupid skeletons. What's behind the dragon? Is it your garden or anything? No, but the dragon will can drop some really nice stuff, and the, and the best thing that she drops is a bow called Reach of the Red Mother, and it's the strongest bow in the game. So if she drops it, I call dibs. Uh, okay. Oh, let's get uh, Dancer Dave here to heal our corruption. Okay, you guys good? Yep. B, your corruption gone? Yep. All right, let's do this. Um, here, actually, I'm going to poison up my daggers. Her first attack is going to be a fire attack, so try and get underneath her belly when she gets to us. Like I just didn't do. Get uh, 20 stacks of bleed on him, and I'll switch to the mace. Get some sunders going. She's almost dead. Oh man, I'm almost dead. Yeah, Damn. that tail hits pretty hard. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Okay, she's got. Um, the final breath of the Red Mother, which is a torch that burns for a really long time. So if one of you guys want that, you can have it. Um, and you can have all the other stuff, too. Where is silver? Oh, I need the, the bones off this thing, or at least a few of them.
Pix, did we take you down into um, the pit and to get the dragon bone recipes? I can't remember. Negative. Okay, we need to do that at some point. In fact, we got to go down there to kill that dragon for uh, for the end game, anyways. Okay, so let's put the demon blood in there. I'm in pretty good shape right at the moment. Actually, here, let's put those there. Put these what's, here. what's through that spooky door down there? Nothing. It doesn't go anywhere. Okay, now let's go uh, up this way. There's also a green dragon you can kill, but I don't think she dropped. I think she drops a skeleton key, but I don't think she drops anything special otherwise. So we don't necessarily need to kill her right now. ESO is not bad. It's a departure from the Elder Scrolls style, though. Oh, okay. Yeah, I've never, I've never played it. Um, I know it's been around for a few years now. Pixie. Just coming up the hill. Should be. Yeah, she's coming. There's another group of relic hunters down here. Um, this is also not a bad place to farm them. Just FYI. And I think there's a couple gold and silver chests too. Okay. We have a, a white boss. Uh, well, actually, he's kind of like fluorescent blue, but you know what I mean, white. Uh, to kill over here. Pokey pokey mate. You'll dance for me now or swing for me later. Seven stars out of ten, your main character is a combat medic in uh, ESO. That's cool, man. When I played WoW, my main character was a paladin. Um, sometime around the Lich King, when they came out with that, um, they'd also uh, really uh, beefed up uh, Ret Paladins. And man, we could do so much damage. It was just crazy how much damage we could do. They were actually made them a little too OP, I think. <laughs> so that that was fun. Okay, let's go this way. Yeah. The last boss we're going to kill is called the... Uh, the Brute. Huh. Got a couple baby dragons we can kill here if we want for more bones and stuff. you guys harvest that one if you want. I've got bones. I 
There's one more right over here too. I'd say the Brute's probably the easiest boss to kill <clears throat> in the Unnamed City because he's just, he's pure melee, he doesn't do anything crazy, but he can put bleed on you though. <laughs> Sorry. Hoser. <laughs> Here he comes. Oh man, you screwed up my my power shot. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> And that's all the bosses in Forbidden City, or not Forbidden, Unnamed City. I don't know why I call it Forbidden City. It's not forbidden. Okay, one more thing to show you before we leave. Hold on, I gotta go find Pix. She got lost. Oh, yeah. there she is. Okay. Okay, take a look down here. Pretty cool, huh? Oh, yeah. Cool. That's why I had you look up when we were down there. That's buried. Yeah, I wouldn't go down that way, though. <laughs> Unless you have a parachute. Okay, let's go to Sepper Maru, which is actually back the way we came. And we're going to hit the wine cellar. Nice. You guys got supplies, food, drink, bandages, medical, all that? I'll need some water once we get to some water. There, there's actually water in the dungeon, so. <laughs> Sit pick. Sometime, though, before you finish the game um, try and make it a point to go back and talk to those guys because they have a lot of good backstory for the game okay you can just ignore these guys
Uh, go through the right gate. Whoopsie. That's not going to make him happy. <laughs> I'm sorry, man. I didn't mean to do it. You just need to get over yourselves. Okay. Um, have you been here, Pix? Uh, yeah, I have. Okay, so Conan's right in there. He's yeah, I've talked to Conan. Okay, good. So he's also got story stuff for you. Hey, uh, Leanne's like causing issues. Yeah. We just need to get into the into the dungeon. So it's just right behind the bar here. Just go right into this door here. Did you guys bring lights? Uh, no, mine broke. Okay. Well, you, I've got some torches, and we've got we've got gl glimmer men too. I got this fire breath torch. If you want that. Oh yeah, that'll that'll be good. Uh, I'm gonna take that. For the north. For the north. Okay, so um, what we're going to do is if you look way off in the distance there, you'll see a structure kind of with some beams of light shining on it. That's that's our destination, and, uh, but we have to work our way through these uh, cities with a bunch of undead and stuff in them to get there, and there's three bosses in total to kill. Cool. Um, is this the final dungeon, supposedly? Uh, well, it kind of it's the final dungeon that we're gonna do, but most people consider the War Maker dungeon to be the, the, you know, the hardest one at the end. Uh, which we did last week. Yep. Now, if you look. Um, kind of behind these buildings, there's chests, and there's also these little things that give you what's called Kari steel. And it's like a special kind of metal that you can make, like, Kari weapons and armor with. Our thralls are just going ape shit on everything. I think there's some, yeah, here's one right here. So, come back here and take a look at this, you guys, just so you see what it looks like. That that little chest there, that'll have Kari steel in it. Oh, I found a bunch of those. Did you? Okay. I don't know what no, they do, though. No, the ones you found were relic fragments. They look the same, but these oh. have, yeah, these have Kari steel. What do those relic fragments do? They give you more relic fragments, but it's just a chance. <laughs> mini boss guy there. Oh, word of advice, don't fall off these cliffs. <laughs> Bad things will happen. That's good advice. Okay, you gotta 
want to get a bit of a run and jump on this one. Okay. One thing that kind of sucks about this dungeon is if you're a shield user like I usually am, you can't use it because you have to have a torch, otherwise it's way too dark to see anything. Should send your horse home, OG. Yeah, uh, he's Keeps carrying. The way. He's carrying supplies for us, though. Oh, okay. Of course, I guess I could always just summon him to us. So yeah, I'll send him home. Okay, there's um, a lore book right here. 93 days after the fall, the ritual will proceed. The only course that remains for us is apostasy, to renounce the god who has abandoned us and seek new allies in the darkness. Kor is confident that he can control whatever the ritual summons. He has demonstrated his powers in the past. The doors of the temple have been shattered and the priests confined to their living quarters. We are prepared. Actually, I think we missed a, a scroll back up here, too. Me and me mates are thick as thieves. Oh, hi, Skellies. Let's see if there's any Kari Steels back here. Oh, there's you. There's some silver and gold. Another chest. Climbing gloves, did I say flaking? Oh yeah, those are good. Grab them. You can get climbing gloves and climbing boots, and what if you have both of them equipped, you use about thirty percent less stamina when you're climbing, which means you can climb further, of course. We have climbing boots at the um base. That's good. Yeah, right here. 57 days after the fall, our situation grows ever more desperate. The food is gone, there are no animals left in the city, and cannibalism is rampant. Even the rocks have been scraped bare of their lichen. Kors presented the idea of the ritual to the people, and it did not go well. The people are scared, and scared people turn to the gods for help. The priests are only too willing to denounce our apostasy, and they have locked the doors of the temple against us. Kors determined, however, and he is not likely to be thwarted. If you guys go really close to this well, you'll hear like sounds of creepy people moaning in torture or whatever. It's weird. It's weird, man. What well? Oh, no, that well right there. Yeah. It's creepy. Oh yeah, sure enough. Did you get him? I need some water. Actually, I'm going to fill up my thing, too. There is a, um, like, an undead shaleback boss down here, and I think he's the one that drops that water pouch I was talking about. Maruski, how are you? Sorry I missed you. How you doing? Thanks for showing up tonight. Hope you're having a good day. Hi, Miru. Pick says hi, Miru. How long, how long have you been there, Maru? Sorry, I missed you. Uh, this is I'm taking the kids through this dungeon for the first time, so kind of 
not paying attention to chat. Get up there, man. What the hell? All right, let's not go that way then. Okay, um, I think, do we want to go that way yet? Yeah, I think we need to. I've only been through this dungeon once before, so I'm not super familiar with it. Yeah, this is the guy that drops the water pouch. Oh, okay. No worries, man. All right. Thanks for stopping by, Brett. Appreciate it. Hope to see you again, buddy. Oh, he didn't drop it that time. Doggone it. That sucks. Go this way. Hold on, I need to put some stuff on my horse. Okay. Okay, this is the next boss over here. The thing that kind of sucks about this area is it's it's like really thick with fog, so it's kind of hard to see stuff. Oh, I guess it's not as bad as I thought it was. Last time I came through here. Oh shit, I'm getting thumped. Wow, you guys wrecked him fast. Yeah, we're pretty cool. <laughs> okay, there's more lore here. Seven days after the fall, sanity slowly returns those who survived have assembled in the temple district to take stock. All told, over a thousand of us still live, men, women, and children. The event has come uh, to be known as the fall, which is an apt description for the moment when the earth swallowed our city. We still do not know what we have done to anger the great serpent, but the priests are burning sacrifices day and night. Yes, we still live, but there is no light aside from the fire we create ourselves and several species of luminescent fungi. Our survival depends upon working together. Kor, who has a reputation as a mystic and a sage, has suggested that we turn to the library for our <laughs> salvation, poring over the histories that have survived in the search of clues to help with our situation. I know that this is something that I can help with. So the way this story works, if you follow it, is it actually goes backwards. Um, if you read the first book at the beginning, which I, I forgot, uh, is actually the end of the story. Um, so the closer you get to the end, you know, the earlier the, the story is, if that makes sense. I don't know, maybe it doesn't. Yeah, gotcha. they're prequels. Yeah. Oh, I need to switch out my torch. I, where's my horse? He's right in front of you. All right, let's put that on you. And... I'm going to 
grab another stack of a full stack of potions and put those on you. Okay, no worries, Mira. Okay, let's go. All right, now let's see. I think we need to go back. Yeah, this go back this direction. Oh no! Oh shit! I was so busy watching the boss's health, I wasn't watching my own. Okay. How'd you die? Oh no! Yeah, yeah, yeah. I did. I'll respawn. Where's it gonna put me though? Oh, all the way back at the beginning. Okay. Uh, just wait up for me. Hopefully nothing's re-popped and I can get back to you, okay? Yeah, I was watching the boss's health bar and then all of a sudden I'm dead. Silly old guy. Hey, you know what, though? While we're here, where's that first note at? So this is actually the end of the story. 107 days after the fall, Kor has failed. We thought we knew what darkness was, but the shadows we knew were nothing more than the absence of light. The, this darkness is the end of hope. Thag is coming, and we cannot stand against it. This is the end. So that's the first thing you read. Oh, shit. <laughs> I know, I'm thinking like, oh, shit. What am I in for here? It's a little bit dark, but at least there shouldn't be any monsters to eat us. Actually, we want to go this way, I think. Okay, there's the creepy well. We want to go up here. Here. Be right back. Okay. I think we went this way. Where's Delencia? Look at me and my dead self. Actually, I'm going to call Dave in to give us a cleanse. Let's move Dave over by Brent so he can get cleansed. I don't know where Pix is. I'm um, like right behind the wall. Yeah, I'm back. <laughs> Easy there, big fella. Okay, let's send Dave home. 
and let's proceed. Press E to interact. Is there another note here? Oh yeah, there is. Three days after the fall, the world has stopped shaking, the dust has cleared, we live, but the world we knew is gone. Our city has been swallowed by the earth. Many have died, crushed beneath the rubble. More are wounded and trapped. We hear their screams echoing in the gloom, but we cannot find them. Why has Set abandoned us? Abandoned us. Well, maybe because he's an evil serpent god? I don't know. You think? Nah. Stuck on the horse. Hey, leave my horse alone. Me, bro. Oh, he killed me. Make sure you choose dungeon respawn. That sucks. Can you just run past him? Yeah. Okay. Just basically follow the main path. You should find your way back to us. <sighs> Too bad he didn't drop that Kari water skin. That would have been nice to have. Where's Batman? Is B here? Oh, I wonder if I lost both of them. Bet you I did, because I don't hear anything. Are you there? Hello? Can you hear me? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I couldn't hear you guys for a couple of minutes there. Where are you, Brent? I'm like stuck behind this uh, little corner wall thing. Can you climb over it? No, it won't let me climb over it. Oh, you're back already? Your stuff's over yes. this over this way. So, uh, I'm here. Uh, oh, did you get out? Okay. Yeah. Just trying to figure out what we were going to do about that. <laughs> it's like a maze. Yeah. All right, let's go up this way.
Hold on, I'm going up. You need some potions? Right. No, okay. I'm good. Okay. Okay. You guys don't have arachnophobia, do you? Nay. Yeah. <laughs> All right, come on in. You're going to love this place. Holy crap. Yeah. Burned her down fast before she does her purple corruption and spit stuff. It's nasty. Aw, oh, shit. I hate that stuff. bunch of chests over here and if you guys need silk there's a bunch of silk in here too or gossamer you have a uh, sickle on you yeah I'm gonna grab some too Six hundred and thirty five, that's probably enough. Good thing it doesn't weigh anything. Delencia, you're actually behaving for a change. I'm impressed. And on to the library. On to the theater. On to the theater. Come on, poke your little white head out of there. Whitish, ghoulish head. Undead head. You got lost. Oh, 
There any chests around all this area? Uh, I don't think so. I, I when I was in here the last time I looked around and I didn't find any. Oh, I think I there was a chest back in the spider room that I didn't find because I've still got a key. Oh, a legendary? You got a skeleton yeah. skeleton key? Alright, you can go yeah. back and grab it, we'll wait for you. Okay, I am definitely using my shield on this fight, but there's a there should be enough light in this room for everybody to see what's going on. This is a pretty tough boss. These fires right here, we have to light or something? Yeah. Let's wait for picks to get here, though. Come get rid of your corruption with Dave. Mist Morn Shield. Oh, that's what I'm wearing. What I have equipped. That's good for taking to the volcano. Dave are dancing. <laughs> B, when I when I dance for you, does it remove all your corruption? So let me. Oh, I'm gonna get back into the right camera view here. I'm gonna send Silver home and Dave home for this fight. Make sure Delincey is following. Make sure Lee is following. Okay. So here's what's gonna happen. We're gonna light these fires. Boss is gonna spawn in. He's gonna start doing pew pew. Uh, but what he's gonna do is. It's a little hard to explain, but he's going to do kind of like a, a dartboard checker pattern thing, pinwheel thingamadoodle on the floor. So parts of the floor are going to light, light up, and you don't want to be standing in that light because then it'll shoot up like this fountain of laser things that um, you don't want to hit you. Um, so th that's kind of his special move thing. Um, and so just, you know, try and avoid that as much as you can and otherwise burn him down. Okay? It it might sound a little weird, but you'll understand what I mean when you see it. So basically when you see like little patterns of light on the floor, don't stand in the light part. Okay? Okay. All right. Everybody full health? Where's my... Okay, go ahead and light the fires. Come on, baby, light my witch fire. One more over there. Get him. Whoa.
Okay, watch out for the light. Oh, it got me! <laughs> Shit! Uh, wow, I didn't know my health was that low. Crap. You were killed by Thag. In the name of Set, identify yourself. In the name of Set, no, shut the hell up. Enemies at the gate. I'm running away. Oh my goodness, I can't believe I died. I looked last time I looked at my health. You did. It wasn't that bad. You guys got him? Yep. Yeah. 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 I've been avenged. And I hope I can actually make it through here. With all these baddies. Uh oh, not good. Get off the bridge so I can jump over it. <laughs> I get killed again. <laughs> ah! Son of a bitch. You I, die again? Yeah, I can't get I can't get you know that bridge that you have to jump the gap on? Oh yeah. They yeah. were blocking and I couldn't get over it. Alright, let's try this again. <coughs> I wonder if he tagged me with his weapon and I just didn't notice it or something. Either that or it was the laser beam light thing of Doodle Sagami. Those are rough. Yeah. This might be tricky, getting all the way back there with full repops. <laughs> we can try and get your stuff. Uh, see, I can't jump over the bridge because dickweed's right there. Oh, shit. Uh, can I do this? Oh. <laughs> okay, that might have worked. Next time, I'm going to try the rail. Oh, shit. All right, here we go. We got this. Yeah, you you guys try and see if you can get all my stuff because I don't know if I'm gonna be able to make it. Either that or start fighting your way back to me. I barely made it back. Yeah, I know. Okay, I'm just gonna jump up on the rail this time. Oh, no. What? 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 Oh, no. <laughs> I almost made it. <laughs> uh, oh, oh, it did. It started me back here. That was weird. Oh, is it a thing where if I get us to, like, a, a, oh, shit, to a certain. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> if I get to a certain point, it, it spawns me back in closer, kind of thing. I don't know. No, see that time. I'm, well, yeah, but I was closer to the to the start. All right, I'll try this again. Boy, this is a bad dungeon to die in at the very end. I'm just gonna throw that out there. When you guys, if you guys leave the dungeon, it'll put you out close to the entrance, so I can meet you there if you can get all my stuff. All right, we're working on it. Okay. I'm going to keep trying in the meantime just because... There we go. Okay, we got across. There. All right, so we got away from the humans. Now we just have to get away from the ghosties. Oh, shit. I'm waiting for my stamina to come back. I know. It's a death loop, tat. <laughs> oh, no, not good. Not good. Go away. No, 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 no. Not this way. I can't see a damn thing. It is so dark in here. <laughs> okay. Well, I got further that time than I have so far. Maybe it'll spawn us in a little closer this time. Nope. It doesn't. We're all the way back at the beginning. Hey, here's a note right here. We got all your stuff, so you're good. Okay. Then I'm, I'm just going to go out the, the door. Yeah, that's a that's a brutal place to die at the end in. Holy crap. Does he not have a uh legendary? Uh Lame. I don't know. Didn't he drop what did he drop? This is where they'll come out at when they leave. He dropped uh a Qatari metal 
are still. Oh yeah, yeah. I think that's really the prize because doesn't he drop like seven of them or something? Yeah, he dropped nine, and then he dropped the recipes for him. Nice. I actually don't really care much for the Qatari armor. It's not. You ready? Not my style. Yeah, come over here where it's flatter. Here's the stuff I got. Thralls are over there causing trouble. Chrome's boxy balls. At the gate. All right, take dog. And he got some stuff on my horse and then both my thralls. Okay. Kill the whole town. <laughs> Pretty much. You you wanna you should put them on um def defend me and then they won't just randomly attack anybody. My my and are I think. Oh are they? Well maybe it's my thralls that aren't, I don't know. Okay, so I got my armor and my weapons back. I guess that was everything, right? My There's armor. more. Oh, is there? how Conan's just standing there like, yep. Yeah. yeah, he's like chilling. Oh, man. I didn't have... I didn't have the... Uh, I had the dragon bones and the potions and the arrows and that I don't think I had any of the rest of that stuff might have had the dragon I thought, horns I thought that sword was yours I took it yeah it says it's still in there oh the star metal sword oh you know what yeah you're right that is mine it was what the ones he was using I don't think the rest of that's mine though you can have it even if it is Okay. Oh, excuse me. Oh, B. That shield you have is is actually designed to keep you warm. I didn't know you had that. Oh, really? What's it called again? Tell me the name. It's like soul steel or something. Yeah, like yeah, that? yeah. Soul steel, yeah. That actually will keep you warm. I think I got that from that uh, crocodile, that big crocodile that's near the spanner. Uh huh. Well, do you want to um, try? You want to go try the Frost Temple again with some torches and a bonfire? And Brent might be okay with that shield. This is the shield I had last time we went in, and I was freezing pretty quick. Oh, you had that one too before? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah, I don't know why they changed that. It used to be if you had a full set of Vanir armor, which is like the what the Nords, Nordheimers use, then that would keep you warm. But they, they nerfed it for some stupid ass reason. 
Yeah, I am tired, Miru. I think we're probably about ready to wrap it up for tonight. So we've basically done every dungeon except for the Frost Temple because last time we tried it, we couldn't uh, handle the cold that was in there. But what has to happen now in terms of finishing the game is we need to make sure that both of you get all three of the Scourge Stone pieces. And then we need to make sure you have the five uh, boss pieces. And I know you have some of them, but you probably don't have all of them. So which one of you... Um, grabbed the the diadem of the giant kings when we did the barrel king last the crown thing i think that was me okay so you need that yeah, was me. you need the witch queen's mask you need the star of the champion which we get from the undead dragon down in the pit um let's see what else you need you need the the Tears of Two Nations, which one of you got last week when we did the Black Keep. I got that one. And you need uh, the Trapezoide something or other from the Volcano Boss. Trapezoidean. Yeah, that thing. So do you guys want to... Um, Go redo those bosses together, or is that something you want to do on your own, or what? How do you want to handle that? I'd kind of like to try it on my own. Okay. So the scourge stone pieces, do you guys have those? I have those, I think. All three of them? Uh, mm, I don't know. Okay, so you get. That's something we should probably do on the next stream. Let, let's let's focus on getting the scorch stone pieces on the next stream, okay? Um, and then oh. if, if you guys can can try and get those other parts um, on your own before the next stream, um, you know that would determine then how much longer we're gonna do this on this server. All right. Sounds good. Yeah, just if if you can't remember the pieces, just look it up on the wiki. All right. You're basically looking for the um, the key the um, keystone. I think it's called keystone. Cool. All right. Well, I think I'm gonna go ahead and wrap it up here for tonight. Unless you guys want to run and do the Barrow King really quick again, it's not very far from here. I just teleported home. Huh? Okay. Yeah, let's just wrap it up then. I'm kind of tired anyway. And then um, when when do you guys want to play again? You want to try like Friday night or or Saturday or something? Friday night's good. Okay, let's plan on Friday night. And then, uh, yeah, it'll be fun. Cool. Okay. All right, guys on the stream, thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed <coughs> tonight. And um, just letting you know again, uh, just as a reminder, we're, we're only going to have a couple more streams, one or two more, on this server on Conan Exiles, and then we're going to move uh, to Isle of Sifta, and we should have... Um, hopefully, everybody who originally joined us on Exiles will will come back and, and play with us on Sifta. And it's gonna, I've never done it myself. I've never even watched anybody else do it, so it's going to be a brand new experience. So I'm looking forward to it. And also, uh, based upon how the poll is going on, on the YouTube channel, it looks like the majority of you would be interested in seeing me uh, do a single-player Let's Play of Conan Exiles. Uh, so, based upon that, uh, that's probably going to be coming up here fairly soon, because I'm excited to do it. I've really been uh, enjoying the game. So, uh, with that, have a great rest of your evening, and hopefully we'll see you guys on Friday. Bye-bye. Good night, Tad. Good night, Good night, Good night.